overclockwise. Qbert overclocks Bender to help him beat Mom's sons at video games, thus violating his warranty. This causes trouble for the entire Planet Express crew. What did I teach you about tinkering with machinery? How? You taught me how. Meanwhile, Leela feels uncertainty about the future of her relationship with Fry. I mean, if we were together, where would we be ten years from now? Still here? Definitely. Or somewhere else. The first of the Comedy Central seasons was written before the show was definitely renewed for a second Comedy Central season, and the writers seemed reasonably certain that Comedy Central wouldn't bring them back for only one season, but just in case, they wrote this to be ambiguously final. But this is supposed to be watched as, you know, maybe a one of our many last episodes of Future Up. <laughs> we get a lot of those. As David said at the table read, it has everything that you'd come to expect from a Futurama series finale episode. <laughs> as a result, this is a really fun episode, but it's not a great finale. The only finale-esque elements to the story are the speculation that Bender and Leela might be gone forever and Planet Express might be going out of business, but I feel like Planet Express is constantly on the verge of going out of business, so even that doesn't feel very final. The final scene of the episode is a really good season finale scene. I like that a lot. But also, this episode isn't even really the season finale because reincarnation came afterward. And reincarnation is certainly a great title for a potential series finale of a show that keeps coming back. But since that's a Tales of Interest or Treehouse of Horror style anthology episode, it doesn't really count as the final Futurama story of the season. Also, this one ends where it says level over, but originally you had the uh, series over. That's right. This Yeah, this one used to be the third segment. We thought it might be the last episode ever. So yeah, the joke at the end was instead of game over, series over, which made us laugh in a yeah. sad way. In a sad way. Again, I'm not knocking either one of these episodes. I like them both a lot. But if these had been the final episodes of Futurama, I think that would have been pretty disappointing. Fortunately, we still had more time with the gang, so this didn't have to be goodbye. 